Okay, here we go. We're going to fill up this void right here is where the rollers were and there's a place on the side of the door right there where the uh, uh, where the lock came through and everything. So we're going to fill that up. We're going to take a piece of newspaper and uh, stuff it in here as a stuffing backer for some caulking. Let me stuff that in there. Kind of bring it. About like yeah. Uh, all right. I'm going to fill that void up with some caulking. And then <clears throat> we've got this strip right here and what it is is uh, uh, again some of the same metal it's a um, trim coil vinyl trim coil so or aluminum so what I did is bent it back a little bit and made it a little longer than these screw holes are right here so I screw on the outside edges and put that in right there and screw it in Just like that And clean it off. Sponge and water. That'll be sealed up. Again, the inside of this is all sealed anyway. This track goes to nowhere but over here and, and all like that. So that's how I'm gonna do these and continue on around the outside with that. Okay, after all this caulking on the back, I washed it with water to dress it. Clean it off, but it left a little residue, you know, it's a little tough, but a little bit of uh, paint thinner on a rag, takes that stuff right off, cleans it right up, makes it pretty. Okay, so that cleans that up. Okay, finally, we need to fill in, fill over these holes right here. What I've done is took an, uh, cut the, fl of the flange off of the uh, door frame itself uh, and it makes some little patches like this right here and I've sanded sanded the uh, both sides this and this I'm going to attach it with some super glue I'll put it right around the hole where it's going to need a seal Oops, might have got too much there And clamp it. And then do the rest of them. What we're going to do here also to clean up the rest of this. Take a knife, cut down here, clean off the excess caulking, clean the mirror or clean the glass, and it should be ready for install or test. Okay, here they are, two completed panels from vinyl sliding doors, and each panel weighs approximately 55 pounds. Uh, each panel contains about three quarters of a cut or three quarters of a gallon of water a piece, and uh, all they need is a little cleaning up, and they're going to be hooked together just like you see them. And there you go.